team deathmatch. Lock in, gentlemen. Let's get to work. I jumped straight into a game and I get killed. Because that's just the way of Call of Duty, isn't it? Hey guys, uh, OMG it's Max here. I'm back again, and as much as I'm sick of Call of Duty, I thought it's the main bulk of my channel. So I thought, obviously, I should go back on it. So I have. And as much as I resent Call of Duty now, I thought it may have been necessary. So, we're back on Advanced Warfare. The OG, the best Call of Duty ever made. The innovation. The incredible Call of Duty we're all looking for. The new Call of Duty that everyone loves. Fuck no. The Call of Duty that I find the, well, second shittest. And that's saying something considering how bad Modern Warfare 3 was. But anyway, I'm back on it. And getting shot in the back again. Now, I want to address some issues with Call of Duty, and I know it's going to be another rant, and you're probably thinking, oh my goodness, not again, Maxi. But I want to address some things, because I've been playing on a lot of Battlefield recently. Ooh, supply drop that no one cares about. But I've been playing on a lot of Battlefield 4 recently, and you know how much of a fanboy I am of that. So, I thought I'd compare the two, although that's a bad idea because there's been so many comparisons in the past but I'm gonna do it anyway so my first kind of issue with advanced warfare and Call of Duty in general is um, it's like it's unoriginal it's not fun anymore it's the same old game just just like slightly improved but not even improved to an extent where it's enjoyable and it's new and it feels different because Call of Duty hasn't felt different since... Personally, I don't think it's felt different since Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 was a great game. Like, Black Ops 2 was my favourite multiplayer, Call of Duty. But since that, Call of Duty's just gone downhill. Like, seriously, Ghost was okay. I didn't really mind Ghost that much, although it just wasn't an incredible Call of Duty. But then you got Advanced Warfare, which just really pisses me off these days. Like seriously, I am so bored of it. I I couldn't I I can't even believe I brought myself to get gameplay today for you guys because like although it's the main like bulk of my channel. It's not a game I like. It's not a game I enjoy playing. It's not a game that I say to my friends, Oh, yeah, I can't wait to go home after school and play on Advanced Warfare. You know? That's like... That's like ridiculous. That's a ridiculous thing to say because I don't say that. Nobody says that anymore. Unless you're a 12-year-old fanboy, you shouldn't be playing the game anyway because it's rated... Uh, uh, you know, it's rated an 18 and you're 12. But, you know... Nobody does that anymore. Call of Duty isn't a game where you're going to be excited to come on to it after a long, hard day at work or a long, hard day at school. You know, I don't, I don't come home and say, "Oh, mum, I'm going to be upstairs for hours playing on Advanced Warfare. Sorry, you won't see me until dinner." Fuck no, I don't do that. I, you know, I never do that anymore because Call of Duty isn't fun enough for me to play on it for four or five hours on end, you know, and I'm sorry if you're a Call of Duty fanboy, and I'm sorry if you like it that much, but seriously, man, if you are, then you haven't ever played the old CODs, the good CODs, you've just played this one, or the most recent ones, you've not experienced what I experienced, you didn't grow up with Call of Duty, so basically Call of Duty isn't really a different game anymore, it's no different to you know, the old Call of Duty, it's, it, it, for fuck's sake, it's even on the same engine, I mean, what the fuck is that, it's a paladin, you know, overpowered killstreak, overpowered killstreak, laggy servers, still, you know, host migrations, because they can't be asked to do servers where, you know, you're gonna, like, have fair, uh, servers, where it's gonna be just done all by Call of Duty, it's, players are gonna be a host, what the fuck is wrong with that? 
yet successful in Battlefield because there are actually powerful servers. There are actually powerful hosts who can who, who can afford to spend their times hosting servers that people enjoy themselves on. My goodness, I don't enjoy myself on Call of Duty anymore. I don't have fun playing it. It's it's a boring game that has not changed for a few years and I'm sorry, but if Call of Duty Black Ops 3 is anything like this game, or if it's anything like the last Call of Duties and there's no difference, I'm sorry, Call of Duty is dead. Because you look at games like Battlefield, they're new, they're, they're, every year they bring out something new. Yeah, Battlefield Hardline is a bit of a letdown simply because it's no different from like Call of Duty, there's a lot of similarities. Um, but like Battlefield is just generally a more success well it's a better franchise because it's a more realistic franchise I'm not going to say it's more successful because it's not unfortunately even though it should be it's not a more successful franchise but like Call of Duty is dead Call of Duty is not a game that I want to come home and play Call of Duty is not a game where I'm going to enjoy playing anymore because seriously I, I'm just so sick of it I mean look at that that's ridiculous. This game relies heavily on the idea of hide and seek. Like, that's another problem I have with this game and most Call of Duty's now, is the idea that, you know, look there. That's, that's a game that, oh my god, I'm sorry guys, I've just had a massive rent. But one problem I do want to pick out is the fact that if you get seen first, that person's going to kill you. Or if you see someone first, you're going to kill that person. It's not like that in Battlefield. You get shot first, you still have the chance to turn around and shoot someone. Because it's realistic. Because it, it depends on how well you perform with the gun. It depends on how well that gun actually performs. You know, th that's not something they've had in Call of Duty for years. You know, skill with gun is... N skills with guns don't exist anymore. There's no such thing as a skill with a gun. Because Call of Duty just can't be fucked to make an original game that, you know, is good. It's gonna, oh my goodness, they don't even have the fucking replay value anymore like Battlefield do. And I'm sorry to say that, but Battlefield is a far better game with far better graphics, far better sounds, far better servers, far better connection, a better community, a better fan base. Call of Duty is just a drug for blind 12 year old fanboy fucking like squeaky voices who haven't gone through puberty yet because they know nothing else they don't know anything else other than call of duty that's all i think call of duty is you know look at that a weak server if i go into find a game and i go on to kill confirmed there are no games whatsoever no games found what the hell's wrong with that my internet is brilliant what the hell's wrong with that i find a game every single time on battlefield 4 and the servers are always full. They're always, you know, good, good servers, good strong servers. I barely ever um, experienced lag. I'm sorry, but it's just, it's just bullshit. Call of Duty is bullshit now. And if you think you, you, you're cool by playing on it, or you know, cool by, um, just, yeah, just cool by playing on it, you're not, because it's dead. You'd be cool if you played on the old Call of Duties. You know, play on Modern Warfare 2, great game. Play on Black Ops, great game. Play on Black Ops 2, great game. All these great games, and now they have fucking died. Call of Duty is dead, guys. And I'm sorry to say that, you know, I wasn't particularly very excited for E3 this year. I'm not excited for the Black Ops 3 reveal because, in my opinion, it's going to be shit. It's not going to be any different than advanced warfare it's going to be the same old game there's going to be no replay value like there is in battlefield and i'm sorry but that's just my opinion and probably the opinions of a lot of other people but call of duty is dead call of duty is no more and that depresses me because i love call of duty it's one of the coolest franchises of all time but now that it's dead i can't be asked to play on it anymore and 
you know, I may put in one more game of Advanced Warfare and upload it to YouTube because I just cannot be bothered to play Call of Duty anymore. I cannot be bothered to even get gameplay of it because I, I, you know, I, I couldn't even bring myself today to even get gameplay. That's how bored I was of it. I, I've, I'm going to upload Battlefield 4 gameplay and then this because Battlefield 4 is a game that I prefer. Battlefield 4 is a game that I actually enjoy playing. This is bullshit. This is a game that isn't fun. Y you get killed all the time. You don't have fun playing. It's not an original game. There's no difference. The engine is still the fucking same engine. So the game is still the same fucking game. Still the same waste of money. It's just rename something different looks slightly different but it's the same fucking game so i'm sorry guys but you're wasting your money if you buy the next call of duty um you know you you, you really are wasting your time and your money and I, I would advise not getting it because it's just a waste of time so this has been pissed maxi this has been you know the rant of maxi this is probably the rant of the fucking year from maxi because he is pissed off with Call of Duty now, and I'm sorry, like I say, if you're a fanboy, good for you, you're a 12-year-old deluded bastard who doesn't know anything, if you're a fanboy of Call of Duty, and I'm sorry, but that's just my opinion, Battlefield is a better franchise, go play on that, the only reason why you don't play on Battlefield is because you're so good at Call of Duty, you suck cock on other FPS games, that's all it is, so yeah, I'm sorry for the rant, guys, um, I'm still going to put this up just to get the message across but I guess I'll see you in the next video so until the next episode I'll see you later